do you want? A place to crash, like I said. No, you always want something big behind the little favor you ask for. Why would you come here? Why do you want to open all this up Honey, again? Honey, look. I didn't mean anything. <laughs> Leave. Uh, I, I've got to stay. This is where I got to be. No. Honey. No. You're leaving now. Filed a complaint, said she was being followed. The complaint was investigated. It was closed out. Yeah, I thought I needed a closer look. Why, Randall? Of all the complaints in this precinct, why that one? And why'd you call Swift? What does he have to do with this? I knew he was looking for the dead guy, Maxie, her ex-husband. It looked like the lady could be in trouble. You were doing a favor for Swift? Yeah, but I was doing my job too, Captain. You were acting on your own and without authorization. And by the book, you could be charged with abuse of authority. Strictly speaking, Captain, that may be. But I see it different. The department doesn't work on opinion. It works by the book. And if you can't learn to follow the rules, then maybe you better examine how much you really want to be a cop. You know, Randall, one day you're going to have to choose. Stay on the job or get out. But if you make the wrong decision, you can't go back. Why wouldn't you hear Bo out about Tom Luddy? Because he was wrong! There's a chance he was right. But you were afraid to back him up because of what it might do to your career if he was wrong. Well, that's a hard thing to prove. I plan to try. I shouldn't have asked you to do it with no backup. You didn't ask. I volunteered. Yeah, still, you wouldn't have been there. What we'll Lucinda say? No, uh, you filed a report with I. I'll be notified. <laughs> that sucks. I'm sorry. I don't sweat it. I didn't shoot the guy. What are you going to say? You can't park on a public street? <laughs> I'm not going to let you take the fall for this. I'm not going to take the fall for this. Cool. Can you turn up on the gun? Nah. It's probably in the train by now. What was it? 22. Shooter was a pro. So close he could have used a BB gun. What about personal effects? I said these said keys, wallet, watch, chains, the usual. It's the last I'll see of it, too. Why is that? 
stuck in. What? The G's. They took everything, man. It's like a contest between the feds and the department. You know how it is. Damn. I didn't expect Maxie to show up there. What the hell was he thinking? His ex-wife lives in the building. You know that? That's right. It's his ex-wife. They haven't seen each other in ages. Why now? I don't know. He's probably scared on the run. Had no other place to go. Suspended. Can you believe it? Can't even get into my own office. Oh, well, works is just covering his ass. He'll keep you out of the loop. By the time this whole thing's finished, he'll look like Bo Maxi's best pal. Yeah. Works hated Bo. Hated him. His independent attitude. I don't care. I miss Bo, and him being gone is all that matters. Why do you think he went to Janet's? I mean, he didn't go to your place or call you. Bo had so many cases go sideways. Started to think that someone in the department was sabotaging him. He started to doubt me. Because I like you. I don't like you. I think you are a pompous, perfidious ass. Maxie and the girl, they were supposed to be controlled. But you keep dropping the ball, Gordon. I have to be careful. And I have to do your job twice. Now, this time, this man, this Swift, he's all yours. It's either him or you. You understand? Oh, I'll take care of it. Tom, Tom, I will. This first shipment of bills, he's due off the ship in a few hours. If this deal goes, then we'll do it over and over. Isn't that right, Burke? <laughs> right, Mr. Luddy. <laughs> Dead right. And we can all become very rich as a result. But first, this deal has to go. It's a done deal. Count on it. You know, I don't like you, Gordon. Because you are short on nerve. You, you have no guts. You are not much of a man, you know, Gordon. Now, you get back those bills that Maxie took. There's a tiny flaw in it. Engraving, and if this is discovered uh, before I deliver the deal, then the super note is worthless. And, and so am I. And Gordon, so are you. and Swift is involved up to his neck. Being involved doesn't mean Excuse he broke me. the law. He killed a man, Captain. The man had just shot your agent, and he tried to shoot Swift. I mean, in his place, you'd have done exactly the same thing. It was justifiable. Have you identified him, the man Swift killed? Look, we know who he is. He's a small-time hit man, but we don't know who hired him. I don't have jurisdiction in this. I can't arrest Swift. You could. I want him in a vice, out of the way, until the investigation of Maxie's death is complete. I can't do that. Can't or won't. Take your pick. Well, you helped me before when Maxie was killed. You cut the red tape and bent the rules. I would have had to wait a week for the transcript of Patterson's interrogation if it had gone through channels. You got it right to me. That was different. You're asking me to violate Swift's rights. I won't do that. Well, look at the upside. A favor done makes a favor do. You could do worse than have a federal agency in your debt. Call it professional courtesy if it makes you feel better. Take your professional courtesy back to Federal Plaza. It's out of place here. Fine, Swift. Take him out of circulation for a while. It'll be our secret. Don't ask me again, Mr. Works. I don't break the law for you or anyone else. Good day. <laughs> 